to Cooking with Jaw Unleashed. You're probably wondering why I have a cooking show now, and it's very simple. I'm the best freaking cook of all time. Today I'm gonna be teaching you how to make pork chop. And here's what you do. You flip it up and dang it. You flip it up and down, you treat it like a good piece of meat. Because you gotta make sure you get those grill marks. Otherwise, you're a failure. And ah, it has been completed. You see those sear marks? Ah, uh, can you leave me? I'm busy eating my pork chop. In today's world, there are a ton of amazing recipes. You have people like okay. Gordon Ramsay creating masterclass works of art. Things that you could numb on very hard. But then on the other side of the coin, you have the internet making stuff. <laughs> For as long as I can remember, the internet has been ruining a lot of things, and recipes are definitely on top of that list. Because recently, it has been brought to my attention that there is a subreddit dedicated to the absolute worst recipes to exist. Things that would make your mama tear up. And me being the man of exquisite taste, of course I had to take a look at this. And of course I wanted to bring you on this journey, because if I'm gonna suffer, you're gonna suffer with me. And by God, I know we're gonna be suffering. But Joe, what's the name of this subreddit? Give recipes, but- Advertiser friendly. Oh crap, did YouTube just censor me? Well, in case I have to change it up, I guess. Give recipes, but crappy. I am terrified to take a look at these because I have seen some of this stuff before and every time it's just pain. It takes me to Spain with all Yes. So get your chef's hat, get your frying pan, and get your Gordon Ramsay body pillow because we are going in now. And to start it off, I want to go and show you the first one that started it off for me. I don't even know what's going on. This is the top rated one now and it's like, it's bad. So one thing you'll notice here is that they have squid, shrimp, asparagus, and watermelon. What sort of terrible creation are they about to unleash on us? And it starts out tame enough. You're like, okay, I guess I could see these going well together. Soon things start taking a turn because he's using gelatin for some reason. Very bad. And he's mixing it all together in this freaking, and then putting it into the watermelon with the squid. Oh my God. Why is this a thing? Look how bad this looks. Look how bad this looks. Oh my God, that's so bad. <laughs> Look at it. Look me in the eyes. Tell me that doesn't look terrible. If you eat it, you're crazy. And you know one of my favorite comments to go with this post is? Oh, that's nasty. Uh, I can vouch for this as well. And you know one of the worst parts about this? That they wasted a perfectly good watermelon. They hollowed it out and they're probably going to be using it for another absolutely terrible freaking experiment. It looks so red and scrumptious. <sighs> Tasty. So that was the first thing that we saw on this subreddit. What else awaits us? Now, all these next ones I have not seen yet, so I'm going into this blind. A lovely burger. <laughs> okay, what's this starting out with? What is that? Okay, that's guacamole, I believe. And, okay. I mean, it doesn't look half bad. Wait, wait, hold up a second. What is happening? What is happening? What is this? Stop it! No! No! <laughs> Dang it, why? Why would you do that to a delicious burger? Holy crap! I can't believe that. That makes me aggressively angry. I don't see a problem. Only problem here is that there aren't enough pickles. Boy. Excuse me, but I thought I asked for extra pickles. <laughs> You know, I gotta say this, and I mean this from the bottom of my heart. If that's how many pickles you want on your burger, what is wrong with you? Seems like you may have a problem. Acupuncture chicken. What? Oh god, this one has sound apparently. Ah! Okay. What is this? Yogurt? What is happening? I don't like this. I don't like where this is going. Garlic? Ginger? Chili? Okay. I genuinely don't understand what's happening here. Oh, are they gonna pour the egg in the chicken? What's wrong with this? What is happening? Now look, I gotta pause for a second. I know the video is almost over, but I just, I wanted you to know. The fact that the video looks so professional is the best part of this. <laughs> it's like you're creating a monstrosity, but at least you're professional about it. Okay, but what are you doing with all this? What are you doing? Why? Why would you acupuncture the chicken though? Oh, it looks really gross. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know why, but it just looks so wrong. Like the way you got it cooked, it's against the Geneva Convention. What the crap was that? Why is that a thing? I don't understand. 
What was the reason for the sticks? I think it's to keep your cat from eating it while you go to the bathroom breaks. <laughs> you know what? It all makes sense now. I'm gonna go make my own acupuncture chicken. This whole subreddit's actually the worst. I want you to know this. Oh uh, yes, squash Skittles are a real delicacy. Oh uh, yes, the squash Skittle craze. I know of it. Just kidding. I know absolutely zero about what's happening here. I'm scared. Mom, I'm frightened. Can you come pick me up from school? They're squishing Skittles again. Okay. Oh. Oh. Excuse me? I don't get what's happening, and I don't know if I want to get what's happening, because... Okay, first of all, I just want you to know, I actually think that that looks really satisfying. I don't know why, but I see that scooter, I'm just like, ah, satisfaction. I think they should just stop it there, because I feel like it's going to get worse. <laughs> all right, they're cutting it up. Oh, God. That's the food? That's the food. What's wrong with this world? What is wrong with this world? I guess I just don't understand the delicacy of a squashed Skittle. I don't freaking know. I can taste and feel the texture of this image and it's not good. Hold on, guys, 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 guys. I want you to know, I just found the worst comment of all time ever. And I gotta get close to the microphone for this one. Horrible technique. They should have chewed the Skittles first and then spit them out. Saliva will help the ball stay together and also add a layer of juiciness. I recommend serving this with a tantalizingly cold glass of Coca-Cola. Why? I don't even want to do this video anymore. I've, I've suffered so much, and that comment was the worst one I've ever seen in my life. So, uh, yeah, squash skittles were a mistake. <laughs> WTF did I just watch? It's never a good sign when a post starts out like that. Holy crap, look at this awesome, like, quality. Okay, so you have the dough, the sauce, and the cheese. All right. Oh, and of course, the, the singular olive. All right, okay, I, I understand this. Almost ready to bake, but first, Bland? Oh! Oh no, get that smiley face out of here. It does not deserve to be there. Reduce! Add a roasted olive to Why? What is this? Make sandwich for dinner? Oh, I mean, obviously the sandwich is gonna taste a lot better than that monstrosity you just created. Dump it to an aged oak barrel. I hate this so much right now. <laughs> Wait, are they making another one? Their sister but consumed its own tail. There's no excuse for this existing! I don't know, man, but it's making me really hungry. Looking like a real snack! And don't forget the olives! <laughs> Microwave for 10 minutes and bon appetit. Pain. Did I ever mention pain? <laughs> you know, the weird thing is that I don't think it actually tastes bad. It's just that it's a lot of unnecessary work. <laughs> You know, the fact that it was blended and everything, it's probably, I don't know, the texture's probably just gonna be really weird. I don't know, I don't know, I'm, I'm not an exquisite taster. I hated that, I hate it so much. But you know what, I always go to the comments for the words of wisdom, and here's probably the best wisdom I found on this post. Don't forget the olive! Smiley face, smiley face, smiley face, smiley face, smiley face. All right, on to the next post. What the frick? So this is uh, an Instagram one, apparently. Oh my god, what? What? No way. Ugh. That is vile. That is disgusting. I don't know what I expected, but that really was not it. I mean, at least it looks good presentation wise, but like the way that it was made just, mm, I don't like that. <laughs> Put on a glove, you animal! <laughs> See, finally someone has the voice of reason in a Reddit comment. That's a first. How will I get my skin flakes? All right, and we're back, and we're back. It's time to stop. It's the worst, just stop it. Okay, so apparently Courtney, the one who requested this madness, wanted me to take a look at this next one specifically. And it's called Fast and Easy Spaghetti. Somebody touch my spaghetti. Hopefully this isn't the one. <laughs> And it's a gift, so we'll see how this one goes. So why did they spill it everywhere? What? Okay, this is this is already really upsetting. No, stop it. Stop it. This is going great, by the way. I can just, I love this. What's happening? Hot pocket? Crusty type, bruh. So open up the pocket. You just, are you just gonna dump the hot po- This makes me extremely angry. Courtney, why would you do this to me? Oh my God. This is actually the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. Oh, they put it as like the top of it. No, I hate this. That gift legitimately made me so upset. Courtney, I want you to know, I absolutely hate that spaghetti one. I hate you. I don't like it. I don't like it. 
How could you do this to me? That's the best one. Oh, you're so bad. <laughs> I think that's all of the crappy recipes that I can personally handle. Ah! People always ask me, Joe, why are you so loud all the time? Why do you yell? Well, it's because of stuff like this. I suffer for your enjoyment. So I get to scream whatever ah! whenever I want. That's the trade-off. You see, that's the, the synergy that we have. Put me into a place that's painful. Thank you! I wanna go watch like a Gordon Ramsay video now. I just to just to be sure that I don't have to go to sleep knowing that I watch those crappy freaking recipes. When I wanna be engulfed in the life of awesome cooking, I just go to Gordon Ramsay. He's like my comfort place. <laughs> I mean, even though he like yells and screams in every kitchen nightmares and every hell's kitchen kind of thing, it's comforting. Alright everyone, but that has been crappy gift recipes. I, I hope you had a good time. If you had a good time, leave a like on this video and share it with your friends. I certainly enjoyed enjoy doing these reddit videos but my god there's so much suffering going on <laughs> and don't forget to check out my teespring shop to check out this epic merch or hit that join button down below to become an exclusive member of my channel you can get a lot of perks so check them out but yes thank you all so much for watching i'll see you all in the next video and you all stay awesome